akili 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 Today Akili was so active She used her legs to jump high up in the sky and then she used her arms to carry her baby brother around and she used her whole body to dance to her favorite songs. Now, Akili is so sleepy. It's time for her to say good night. Good night, Akili. Look at the palm trees. Look at all that sand. Look at the ocean. This must be La La Land Beach. on his arms instead of his legs. Can you tell Akili who that is? Happy Hippo! I like to read. Wait! Look. I think Bush Baby sees something strange. It's round and it looks like it has two little eyes, a nose and a mouth. What could it be? Wow, wow. Wow, wow. <laughs> Bush baby! <laughs> it's a coconut and it looks just like a face. got a bunch of green leaves, like beautiful green hair. But what should they do with Mr. Coconut? Let's make a doll for Baby Hippo! Ah, what a nice idea! They are going to make a doll for Baby Hippo, but... The doll has some missing body parts. Body! Body? That's right. There are different parts of your body. Baby loves the coconut doll. He's hugging it. But it can't hug him back. What body parts does the doll need so that it can hug too? Arms! 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 Arms!
arms. Well done, Akili. That's right. We need arms to hug. Lion is looking for big sticks that can be strong legs for the toy. He wants it to be able to jump so high. Legs! Good job, little lion! Now it has got two strong legs that he can use for running and jumping. Let's help Akili learn this new word. Hippo is going to be so happy with her new toy. The toy has a head, a beautiful face, a body, two long arms, and two jumping legs. It's time for them to take the toy to Baby Hippo. The doll wants to teach Baby Hippo the body song. Can you sing it with him? Akili. Oh, Akili's mother is calling. She has to find the rainbow to get back home. Let's go! They found the rainbow. But a cloud is blocking the way home. It wants Akili to say the words she has learned today. Legs! Legs? Yes! Remember, you use your legs to run and jump. Let's remind Akili which body part we use to run and jump. Legs! Good job! And what's the next word, Happy Hippo? Good job, Akili! The word cloud is gone and the rainbow can take you home to your mother. Today, Akili will use her arms to paint, her legs to play football, and her head to count. But tonight, when the sun goes down, a whole new adventure awaits. <laughs> hey there, friends. What time is it? It's time for the alphabet. Next 
One is E. E is for elephant. Look at all the elephants. F is for family. F f f f family. G is for goat. Go 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 goat. H is for house. Happy hippo's house. E F G H. The alphabet is really great. I is for insect. Icky icky insect. J is for jump. Jump jump jump. K. Bush Baby is so excited to draw. Get your paper and colors out to draw with Bush Baby. Today, Bush Baby wants to draw his friend Akili. Let's start with the face. You can draw a face using a circle. Let's start with the face. You can draw a face using a circle. That's right. What can we add to his face? Yes, Bush Baby. It needs eyes. Draw two circles that will make good eyes. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Great! Let's try and draw ears. And maybe a little nose too. Good job, Bush Baby. Your face is almost done. What else does it need? <laughs> That's right. It needs a mouth. Let's make a happy, smiling mouth. Great work, Bush Baby! Now that the face is finished, how do we draw the body? Mm, wow, wow, wow. That's right, Bush Baby! You can do so much when you know how to draw a circle. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Bush Baby, I think your friend needs a bigger body than that. <laughs> You've got it, Bush Baby. What else do we need to draw on a body? That's right. Let's draw two arms. Just draw two straight lines, Bush Baby. Great work, Bush Baby. You are such a great artist. You're almost done, Bush Baby. Now, what else do you need to draw a body? Exactly! 
A body needs two legs. You can do it, Bush Baby. Oh, yeah! Well done, Bush Baby. Do you want to colour it? Bush Baby, that looks just like your friend Akili. Wow, wow, Akili! Let's put your drawing up on the wall. That way, your friend Akili is never far away. Boop de doo! Flip one, flip two. I just love to come with you. Let's go! When I say touch your head, touch your head. One. When I say touch your arms, touch your arms. Two. When I say touch your legs, touch your legs. Two. When I say touch your toes, touch your toes. Hey, when I say touch your head, touch your head. One. When I say touch your arms, touch your arms. Two. When I say touch your legs, touch your legs. Two. When I say touch your toes, touch your toes. Hey. Touch your head, touch your head, touch your toes, touch your toes. Touch your head, touch your head, touch your toes, touch your toes. When I say touch your head, touch your head. When I say touch your arms, touch your arms. When I say touch your legs, touch your legs. When I say touch your toes, touch your toes. Touch your head, touch your head, touch your toes, touch your toes. Touch your head, touch your head, touch your toes, touch your toes. Touch your arms, touch your arms, touch your legs, touch your legs, touch your arms, touch your arms, touch your legs, touch your legs. When I say touch your head, touch your head. When I say touch your arms, touch your arms. When I say touch your legs, touch your legs. When I say touch your toes, touch your toes. Touch your head, touch your legs, touch your arms, touch your toes, touch your toes. Touch your arms, touch your legs, touch your head, touch your toes. Touch your toes. When I say touch your head, touch your head. When I say touch your arms, touch your arms. When I say touch your legs, touch your legs. When I say touch your toes, touch your toes. Touch your head, touch your head, touch your toes, touch your toes. Touch your head, touch your head, touch your toes, touch your toes. to read you a great story. Happy Hippo loves to read stories too. Today's story is Good Food to Make Me Strong. One day, Little Lion was eating his breakfast and wondered, hmm, where does food come from? Mr. Cow popped his head in and said, come to my farm. I'll show you. At the farm, the chickens were laying eggs and said, Eggs make your muscles strong and help your hair grow. A farmer was milking a cow and said, If you drink milk, your bones will grow strong. Suddenly, a mango fell on Little Lion who looked up and saw Bush Baby. 
fruits have vitamins that are good for you, said Mr. Cow. The mango rolled down the hill and stopped at a vegetable patch. A rabbit was eating carrots and said, mm -hmm. Carrots help me see far. Look, who's over there? It's Happy Hippo by the pond, cried Little Lion. Happy Hippo was fishing and gave a small fish to Little Lion. <laughs> Eating fish is good for you. It makes you strong, said Happy Hippo. All the way home, Little Lion sang, Milk to make my bones go strong, Eggs to make my hair grow long, Fruits with vitamins each day, Vegetables for health to play, Fish to make me strong, Good food gives me energy to run and play all day long! The end. Did you enjoy that? Until next time, bye! Achilles! How to download an Ubongo app from the Play Store. Before you start, make sure that you have the device's owner's permission and that your data is on. You will also need a Google account. If you don't have one, ask for advice from a wise friend or a trustworthy phone repairer. From your phone's home screen, look for the Play Store icon and give it a tap. Tap the search bar and type the name of the app. Choose the app that you want. Ubongo is under all of the names of our apps. Tap on install and wait. Once installed, tap open. You've done it! Enjoy! If you like the app, then come back and give a 5-star review. If not, then share your feedback. Support Ubongo, the creators of Akili and Me, by donating through www.ubongo.org slash donate.